today I have work from 9.30 to 5.30. Um, I work at Starbucks. And then tonight I'm going to my nonna's house for like Sunday dinner for the first time since my great grandma passed away. And I'm bringing my boyfriend Matt with me. So that's going to be very interesting. And I also just have other miscellaneous work to do, so I might just bring it with me or forget about it. I know I'm going to bring it with me to work, though, so. For some reason, I just feel very, like, tired. I've been sleeping good, but, like, I don't know, I still feel, like, a little bit just, like, I want, like, a nap. And I don't like naps to begin with. But, it, it, Whatever. I'll sleep, like, earlier tonight or something. It also looks really nice out. do it like every Sunday which is like the beginning of the week because I feel like it helps me be more organized for the week to come and like I already have everything mapped out that I need to do this is so fun isn't it last night we went to the feast in the city that little Italy has called San Gennaro and one of my favorite magazine stores is over there. And I got my first Playboy. I am not sure like which one this is, like what edition or issue or whatever, but I've never had a Playboy before. So this is exciting and I can add to my collection. Now I need to get change for work. up your curler and then with this you put to your eye and then your curl of the lash stays up longer so right now i'm getting ready to go to my nona's house i just feel i look defeated so i don't want to look defeated so i hope everybody's day is going great mine was pretty long but you know gotta do what you gotta do you're probably wondering what I'm doing here, I don't know. I was watching Emma Chamberlain's videos the other day and I've been like following her for a little while now. And a lot of people, funny enough, tell me that I'm like somewhat like her, which I don't know how they see that, but it's like a really nice compliment to get, I think anyway. But I was watching her videos and I've been seeing how like her editing style has been changing and I'm very much inspired by it. And like, that's the way I've been wanting to create content for a while now. I just never knew how I wanted to do it. And she like kind of guided me to do that. And here I am. Yep. Another reason why I'm starting up YouTube again I've just been feeling like not necessarily upset but definitely not happy and I don't really know why like there's nothing in my life that I think is bothering me to feel not content but maybe there is 
I'm not like fully aware of it, like subconsciously I'm upset and that's what's making my mood just down. So I wanna do something to like try and make me happier, but not, not mm, I don't like how that sounded. Like I wanna do something that I enjoy doing while also like talking about stuff, not necessarily just feelings, just like everything. And I feel like this would be like a cool way to do it. I don't know. And also just to talk about whatever I want without anybody saying shut up. in the morning and it's a Monday I just got back from doing a 5 a.m. shift at work um, I did not sleep last night and I thought that I was gonna be able to like take a nap when I got home but now I'm wired and I just want to be awake I don't have classes on Mondays but I do have a lot of work not a lot of work but a good amount of work that I do want to like try and get through <laughs> fiber by the way because I can't poop like a normal person I have a cut on my hand and it's in between my fingers and I have this weird like nightmare phobia thing I'll close my eyes and all of a sudden this image comes to my head of me getting paper cuts in between my fingers and on my eyelids and the fact that I somehow got a cut which I don't even know how I got a cut in between my fingers is really freaking me out and it's like triggering this like weird phobia thing that I have. So that's something I was thinking about. I feel like I've been really calm in this video, which normally I'm not a calm person, but it goes back to what I was saying before about how like I've been just like off recently, not I guess sad, but it's just affecting like my energy levels like I'm much more hyper than I've been recently um I don't know I mean I didn't sleep last night so that doesn't really help but oh take a walk because I live in New York and the weather is only going to go down from here and 
I think that I should take advantage of the weather. However, I do not want to walk. I was thinking if I take the, a walk, then it'll make me feel more inclined to take a shower. I promise I'm not dirty. I'm just a little bit lazy. And I'm not the biggest fan of taking showers during the day. Unless, like, I'm going out somewhere in the evening. Then I take a shower prior to that. Which I am. But it's not, like, something I need to take a shower for. Alright, I'm going to shut up now.